Hey everyone, this is going to be my contest entry for 0903 Photography and Anime is My Life 2000. So let's get started. I first made you this little um, uh, heart-shaped plushie with a heart-shaped pattern. And this just reminded me of spring because of the colors. Green, red, orange, um, brown, yellow, white. You know, just and it's got like this little lobster hook, and it's pretty small. It's like this big, and you can put it on your bag or wherever you want. Then I made you another one, and it looks like this. And this is a four-leaf clover plushie. So yeah, and it's front and back, and they're really squishy. And this one has also got the um, little lobster hook thing. And the thing I like about this one is that I put this four leaf clover charm on this. And it's got like a four leaf, uh, I mean, a ladybug on top of it. And it's really cute. And to go with this, if you do wear it, I mean, if you do like put it on your bag or wherever you would like. Um, I also made you these ladybug earrings. And they've got this thing. Um, then I made you this, um cake slice ear uh, I mean ring and it basically looks like this there um there's dark pink um fondant uh yeah I don't know if you know what fondant is but yeah um and it's really textured I don't know if you can see that so there's a there's an orange rose on it and a light pink um leaf and then I put like this these really small um, little braid things and I also put these three um, rhinestones here and it's a ring it's like this so yeah and to go with that I made you guys I mean uh, I made you <laughs> Um, these earrings and they're pendant not like the ladybug ones so sorry um, yeah they're exactly the same as the ring so yeah then I made you um, this um, pop tart and it's got cherry filling and this just reminds me of spring because it's like fruit, so, you know. And there's like um, rainbow, sp rainbow sprinkles on top. And this is all polymer clay, by the way. Not the white part, um, but the little rainbow sprinkles are polymer clay. And I only glazed this part and the rainbow sprinkles so that it would look more realistic. And um, this part is textured and shaded. Don't you can I don't know if you can see that on camera because my camera isn't really high quality but yeah sorry about that um then I made you this really cute broccoli um and it reminded me of um of spring because it kind of looks like a tree and yeah I just really liked it so I can't remember who um this is inspired from. But if I do remember, I will link it in the description bar. So, yeah. And then I made you this cake roll. And this is strawberry, chocolate, and vanilla flavored. And I used transparent here so it would look a bit more realistic. But, yeah, I hope you like it. And there's, like, strawberry little sprinkles on top. And this is a charm, of course. Then I made you this Karopi, um little magnet and this reminded me of spring because of the colors and because Karopi is a frog I guess I think he's a frog I mean he looks like a frog so yeah he just reminded me of spring 
and the mouth and the eyes are painted on with uh, markers um, and yeah they won't come off just saying <laughs> they're not like normal markers they're like um, sharpie ones and see there is a magnet and I also put these little red straps at the back in case you know like someone wants to see so you would see that it's colorful there too so I made that then I made this um, Mario mushroom bracelet and basically it's um, the like to close it it's got these two things I don't know what it's called but if you don't know how you use it you put this part inside here and you just pull it and then it's firm so yeah the first mushroom is this one and I painted the white part of the eyes with acrylic paint and it's really really tiny as you can see then I made this gray one I mean silver one sorry and this one's just a simple one like that then I made this red one which is like the main one sorry if this video is really long um, I have a bit of stuff to show really sorry then I have this green one which is the same as the red one then I have this um, this red one with yellow stars on it and this one took me most of all because I don't have like a little um, mold or anything I had to make them all and I'm not make I'm not really good at making stars so yeah and then I made a blue one so yeah I made that then I made these um, five Easter eggs and they're all different and they're all charms of course so there's this one which is yellow and blue there's this one which is green and yellow and um, light pink there's this one which is um, black and white and this one took me most of all because I don't have like like I said before I don't have any mold or any stuff like that I had to make all these little um, rhombus shapes so yeah I hope you like it though um, then I made this one which is purple and yellow then I made and this one's the last one I made um, this one which is orange and pink and it's got little cubes on each side as you can see so yeah then I made you this charm and this one is a rainbow lollipop I really like how this turned out so yeah and then I made um, my um, bee cupcake and so yeah I put little antennae things here I didn't put the butter because I didn't actually think of it but yeah it is a cupcake and it is a charm and then I made this um, little cloud with raindrops and it's so cute and it's on a cell phone strap on a black cell phone strap because um, I don't have other colors sorry about that but um yeah and this was inspired by Savvy Loves I will um, um, link her tutorial in the down bar because it's really really um, helpful so yeah I made that and then I made you um this um oh my god I can't remember what it's called it's basically the little chick that it's like um Rilakkuma and Kurilakuma's friend I really can't remember what it's called K oh yeah Kiritori so yeah it's basically a Kiritori cookie and it's really flat as you can see and this one's on this black cell phone strap again so basically, um, yeah, again, I don't have any molds, so I had to shape this. Except for the eyes, I just used a pen cap thing to make that. And then at the back, it is a cookie. And this is supposed to be like the fondant stuff. And then at the back, it's like really textured and shaded. Then I made you these three bracelets. Here they are. There's this one, which has this color, these colors. Kind of reminds me of Jamaica, but I don't know. 
I really like the colors. I think they remind of spring. And um, basically, if you don't know how to close this, you put this big part he on um, like depending on the size of your wrist. You just put it here. You have to open it here, and then you go like this, and then yeah. It's basically the same as the Mario Mushroom bracelet, but like with beads. And then I made you this type which is yellow and purple and it's basically the same but different colors and then I made you this one and it's pink and yellow it's got like a center piece which is pink so yeah and then I made you um, oh yeah I'm sorry I forgot I also made you another one of these but it's smaller than this as you can see, I made you this one. It's the same, and it's still a charm, but it's just a bit smaller. And then I made you this little, um, um, I don't know what it's called. It's like a little thing that you put cards on. And basically what I made was um, this sunflower. And it is textured. And, yeah, it is glazed. And it, I really like how it turned out. And then I made you... Um, um, I made you some deco pieces in case you wanted to make like deco den stuff. So, yeah, one sec. I made you this flower, um, and you can use this in deco den or for a ring or for a brooch, whatever you like. Then I made you this like little cookie. Then I made you another cake roll, but this one is, um, this one is just a bit smaller. Like, I made a tiny one, um, but it isn't a charm, it's a deco piece, that's why it's really tiny. Then a bit bigger one, and then a bigger one. Like, <laughs> it's pretty cute. And then I made you, um, some deco pieces, like I just said. I made you, um, all these little cake roll slices. So there's this one, like this um, type, and then there's the pink and white one. I don't know if you can see that. So yeah, there are about, I don't know how many, but there are a few in there. And um, then I made you, I also made you these ones, which are um, orange cake slices, cane, uh, cane slices. And this is all polymer clay, by the way. And there's a, I count, I tried counting them, but they're like about 70 something or more, I don't know. So yeah, this is what they look like. I don't know if you can see that, because my camera's really bad, I'm sorry. And I made this following Tony uh, Edison or Tony Ellison's tutorial on how to make them. And then I made you um, this uh, crepe with a um, with a uh, ice cream scoop on it, and, and it's strawberry flavored, and it is um, textured and shaded. And this one has an it does have an eye pin in it. Then I made you this cone, and it, it's like a waffle shaped cone. So I'm just gonna give it to you like this, so that if, um, so that you can like deco it or uh, de like uh, decorate it however you like. And then I have, um, then I have this uh, three stacked up waffles, and they're all like. They all look like waffles. And there's like chocolate drizzle here and a whipped cream dollop and a kiwi slice. And this is again a um, a charm. You can see the little eye pin in there. And then I made you four of these tiny, tiny um, blue ice cream scoops. And these are all for... Um, for uh, decoing again, and it and they are textured. Then I made you the same ones, but yellow. 
So I have to pick them all up. In a sec. Sorry if I'm making you wait too long. Okay, so I also made you these ones. I made you chocolate flavored ones, which are four again. Um, strawberry flavored ones, lemon flavored ones, and like mint favorite flavored ones. And we're gonna put. I'm also gonna put like little um, chocolate um, little uh, pieces in it, so it looks like it. And you can use this for decoing and stuff like that. And I think they're really cute. So yeah. And then the last thing I have, sorry, I just have to put them all down again. So yeah, the last thing I have is this bunny. And this took me quite a while. So I have to lift the camera a bit. This took me quite a while. Um, basically, it's this um one sec it's this bunny um and uh yeah it's <laughs> this bunny and this reminded me a lot of, about um easter and i made these tiny little flowers and i don't you can see they have like little dots in the center like the yellow part so yeah and then i made other tiny ones and they're like so small like if you confront that with my nail they're really small and then I I shaded the ears to make them look real and they're like pink and they're really cute and then I put a little tail here and then the eye is really small and I put the little um, white dot with acrylic paint but the black part is like the sharpie and then I put little feet on him and then little arms and the cool thing about oh yeah and then I put like this little pink lace with um, white dots and then it's got like a little pink nose. It's really cute. And it just sits there like that. And basically I put two holes on like the arms so you can it can hold anything. Like I made these little flower things out of wire and um paper. So basically what you do is you put it in like this and it just holds it for you. Like this is what it looks like one sec. Okay, I'll try to make you see it better. Sorry. So yeah, this is what it looks like. And this this um was inspired by basically just spring and my mom actually got um this really cute bunny that looks exactly the same but much bigger and it was for Easter. And basically, the bunny she got was, like, filled with little tiny chocolate eggs. So, yeah, that gave me the inspiration of it. And I think this was really cute. And this took me quite a while to make. So, I hope you like it. So, yeah. This is everything. Hope you enjoyed my video, thanks for watching, and bye!